All right guys, so today we're gonna check out a brand new pair of active noise canceling truly wireless earbuds from the company Soul Republic. Now the pair we're gonna check out is the Soul Republic Amps Air Plus. Now this pair does come in at $200, which puts it in range with the Sony's and the One More's and a lot of the other ones that have noise canceling, but what separates these from some of the other ones? Well, let's go ahead and check out some of the features and what it is you get inside the box. Now, the first thing is these are available in three different colors. You have the black, silver, and even in gold. Now, as far as the technology that's in here, they do utilize Bluetooth 5.0, and they do have Aptex and AAC playback. So right out of the box, you're getting some of the best Bluetooth quality you can get. Another huge plus is with watching videos and watching movies, I didn't notice any lag at all. So if you're somebody that likes to watch a lot of media, this is going to be a good pair for that. Now, as far as the IP rating, they do come in rated at IPX4, and I found that to be about the norm when it comes to noise canceling earbuds. I noticed that a lot of them are IPX4, and there's even some that don't have an IP rating at all. Now, as far as what you're getting inside the box, you do get the usual small, medium, and large silicone ear tips, and I'm happy to say as far as the charging cable, they use a USB-C cable. Now speaking of the charging cable, the battery life is kind of interesting on here because on the box it says you can get 8 hours with around 24 hours total using the case. Now what I found to be true is you can get around 7 hours if you use these with the noise cancelling off and then with the noise cancelling turned on you're going to get around 5 hours. It still is pretty close to getting around 24 hours total using the case so that is actually on par with some of the others. Now as far as the case itself, I really enjoy the build of these. It is a wider case, but it's not very big and this is easily pocketable. Now on the back of it, you can see your USB-C input for charging, and then around on the front, you can see your four indicator lights, so you can kind of get an idea of how much battery life is left on the case. Now when you open the case, you can see the single pairing button in the middle, and then you can see the earbuds on your left and right. Now the earbuds of these also have a very nice premium feel to them. I really like that they wrap these in like a silicone material. And what that does is it causes them to have a very nice grip inside of your ear and it keeps them from moving around, which is really good, especially if you're gonna go out and use them outside. Now, as far as the controls on these, these do utilize touch controls and the controls work very well. But the one thing that I'm not happy about is it controls everything but the volume. So you do have to pull out your phone to control the volume volume or you have to summon your smart assistant to tell it to turn the volume up and down. Now I always prefer that the earbuds actually have control over everything, that way you don't have to go reaching for your phone or doing anything out loud. Now another thing on the left earbud, you do have your controls for your noise cancelling. Um, you can turn your noise cancelling on, you can turn it off, or you can turn on your ambient mode, which is going to pull in all of your outside surroundings so you can hear things without actually taking out the earbuds. Now the one thing I want to say about this is the ambient mode does work well, but I still found to be able to hear my environment good enough that I still needed to pause the music. So it kind of defeats the purpose when there are other earbuds where you can hear your environment kind of over the music you're listening to. Now another huge plus about these is the earbuds have the sensors where they will auto pause when you take the earbuds out and then they will resume when you put them back in. Now let's talk about the noise canceling for a second because obviously that's going to be one of the main reasons you look into these. Now the noise canceling I will say is not as good as the Sony's, but it is very, very close. I would actually put it more in line with the one more ANC's, which also come in at $200. So it's about where it needs to be priced when it comes to noise canceling. But the huge plus here is the noise canceling does not affect the audio. Where I found with other earbuds, as soon as you turn the noise canceling on, you start to get a bassier sound or a warmer sound. I found like the Soul Republic stayed exactly where it was, maybe toned down the volume a little bit when the noise canceling came on, but overall you're getting the same sound experience. Now as far as you guys that like to use your earbuds individually, you'll be happy to know that you can use either the left or the right. And as far as the microphones on here, I don't think there's anything special when it comes to the microphones, but it will definitely be fine for phone calls and I don't think anybody will have any complaints. But you guys can be a judge by listening to a test here. Alright guys, so here is a mic test of the Soul Republic Amps Air Plus. Again, I think this does a very good job of picking up my voice, and I don't think most people are going to have any complaints. But this is what it would sound like if you were to take a call. And so now here's the mic test with a crowd noise being played in the background, which you can hear here. 
And this is what it would sound like if you were to take a call in public. So now let's talk about the sound because the sound is where I think these really excel. There's a lot of dynamic range in the treble and in the bass. There's definitely a lot of punch when it comes to the bass. Um, it even has that low resonating rumble that kind of resembles a subwoofer in a way. So for people that are bass heads like myself, this is going to be very pleasing. But the nice thing to know here is that that very nice bass doesn't affect your mids or trebles because the mids still have a very forward sound to them. Uh, male and female vocals always sounded nice and crisp. There was a lot of detail in the vocals and it always felt like the vocalist was in front of you and it never fell behind on the bass or the treble. And that's actually impressive because the treble is also tuned up as well. With having very forward mids and having that bass that has that punch to it but that low resonating feel, it can kind of seem overpowering if the treble didn't match up with those. And the treble has no problem keeping up with them, still pulling out details in songs that usually get lost in a lot of other earbuds. So sound wise, this is some of the best, if not the best, you can get on a pair of truly wireless earbuds with active noise canceling. Now the sound stage and the sound imaging is also very impressive. There's a slight bit of air in the sound so that makes you feel like you're in a larger environment where you're able to pick up details and in instruments but also feel that the instruments have that little bit of distance between you and the artist singing and it doesn't feel like there's just two speakers right in front of you. So the sound imaging and sound stage is also done very well. Now I do have a few cons with these. I think that in this price range it would have been nice to have the case be a Qi wireless charging case. I do feel like the size of the earbuds, because they're a little bit wider than some of the other ones, I think some people with smaller ear canals might have an issue getting these to fit. And then my only other complaint is that there's no app to control different levels of noise canceling or possibly EQ these a little bit differently. I like the fact that the Sony gives you a lot of control over their earbuds, so I really would have liked to have seen an app with these. But outside of that, this is a fantastic pair of truly wireless earbuds. One of the best sounding pairs that have active noise canceling. But guys, that's my review on the Soul Republic Amps Air Plus. Thank you so much for checking out this video. Thank you so much for checking out all the other videos. And as always, make sure to stay tuned for more.